Hi everyone, today we'll look at the best feature of the EasyCast Beam J2 Mini Projector, the EasyWire Mobile. It lets you screen mirror from your smartphones with a plug and play interface and charges your phone while you play games or watch a movie on the projector. So you never have to worry about running out of your smartphone battery when watching movies ever again. When you first set up your EasyCast Beam, you can either power it with an external power source or run it with its own huge 3000 mAh internal battery. Then plug the smartphone charging cable to the USB port of EasyCast Beam Mini Projector. Once you turn on the power, you'll see the main menu with a selection of projector interfaces. Use the direction keys or remote to choose the EasyWire Mobile to access the plug and play screen mirroring with your smartphone. If you use an iPhone, just plug in the lightning cable from the mini projector to your phone and trust the device. In true plug and play fashion, your iPhone screen is shared on the projector right away. Everything you do on the phone is now duplicated on the projector, so you can view your favorite photos on the projector while you charge your phone battery. If you use an Android phone, the process is a little bit different. You plug in the USB charging cable from the mini projector to your phone and make sure you have downloaded the EasyCast app earlier. Then fire up the EasyCast app and click the top right wire icon to connect the mini projector by using USB tethering. Once you enable mirroring in the app, you'll start sharing your Android phone screen with the projector. As a bonus, you'll notice the phone battery is being charged through the cable, so you don't have to worry about the phone running low on battery while you play games and watch videos. To show how perfect the screen mirroring is, here is playing a YouTube video on the big screen. So you can watch your favorite videos and charge your phone battery at the same time. If you like this video, please subscribe to our channel to see more screen mirroring tutorials. And let me know in the comments below whether you prefer to watch movies or play mobile games through your mini projector.